Hotel Boca Chica, it was a really fun project that I did uh, with a very dear friend, Jose Rojas, um, who is working now more as an artist. He runs this amazing gallery, uh, House of Gaga, in Mexico City. And it was a renovation project, but it was almost like an archaeology project. It was a hotel built in the 50s in the old part of Acapulco, the old Acapulco, where the original jet set used to travel. And it was more like reorganizing the spaces and finding like little public spaces that we could reappropriate and repurpose uh, for the hotel. So we designed like this bar that has these concrete umbrellas that provide shade, but also create these patterns on the floor. And it can be used as an event space, but also just as an informal bar. Um, the kitchen was renovated and turned into um, a nightclub, a coco wash, <laughs> uh, which is like brainwash in, in Spanish. And uh, just creating like these different textures in the room, for example, we use like a very smooth surface for, for the wall. So when you're in the bedrooms, you have like a very rough floor. It's like concrete. It's very rough to the, to the, to the touch. But then these reflective walls really bring in the landscape. It's, it's white, but at the same time it reflects either the vegetation outside or just the, the sea that you're facing. So it's, it's a really nice, subtle way to incorporate the landscape into the, the bedroom. We were using uh, raw materials like stone for the public areas, but we were also using materials that uh, people don't associate with um, contemporary architecture like plastic or like neon paint. Um, and it was like uh, doing something that was more playful. We were uh, reinterpreting some of the classic designs of Jean Prouvé and like doing it in an Acapulco kind of way. Uh, so it was, it was a fun project.